A food handler has been holding chicken salad for sandwiches in a cold well for seven hours. When she checks the temperature of the chicken salad, it is 54 degrees Fahrenheit 12 degrees Celsius. What must the food handler do? A. Sell the remaining chicken salad immediately. B. Sell the remaining chicken salad within two hours. C. Cool the chicken salad to 41 degrees Fahrenheit 5 degrees Celsius. D. Discard the chicken salad. The correct answer is D. Discard the chicken salad. A food contact surface must be cleaned and sanitized. A. Before working with a different type of food. B. Every six hours. C. Only if the food handler changes gloves. D. At the end of the food handler's shift. The correct answer is A. Before working with a different type of food. The first step in cleaning and sanitizing items in a three compartment sink is A. Air drying items. B. Washing items in detergent. C. Immersing items in sanitizer. D. Rinsing, scraping, or soaking items. The correct answer is D. Rinsing, scraping, or soaking items. Food being cooled must pass quickly through which temperature range to reduce pathogen growth? A. 65 degrees Fahrenheit to 20 degrees Fahrenheit, 18 degrees Celsius to minus 6 degrees Celsius. B. 125 degrees Fahrenheit to 70 degrees Fahrenheit, 52 degrees Celsius to 21 degrees Celsius. C. 180 degrees Fahrenheit to 130 degrees Fahrenheit, 82 degrees Celsius to 54 degrees Celsius. D. 220 degrees Fahrenheit to 195 degrees Fahrenheit, 104 degrees Celsius to 90 degrees Celsius. The correct answer is B. 125 degrees Fahrenheit to 70 degrees Fahrenheit, 52 degrees Celsius to 21 degrees Celsius. When the kitchen garbage can was full, an employee placed the full garbage bag on a prep table and tied it securely. Then he carried it to the dumpster and disposed of it. What was done L.Y.? A. The employee waited until the garbage was full. B. The bag was disposed of in a dumpster. C. The bag was placed on a prep table. D. The employee tied the bag shut. The correct answer is C. The bag was placed on a prep table. An operation has a buffet with eight different items on it. How many serving utensils are needed to serve the items on the buffet? A. 1. B. 2. C. 4. D. 8. The correct answer is D. 8. What is the minimum temperature that must be maintained when holding hot soup for service? A. 100 degrees Fahrenheit 38 degrees Celsius. B. 120 degrees Fahrenheit 49 degrees Celsius. C. 135 degrees Fahrenheit 57 degrees Celsius. D. 155 degrees Fahrenheit 68 degrees Celsius. The correct answer is C. 135 degrees Fahrenheit 57 degrees Celsius. Which is a biological contaminant? A. Bones in a chicken fillet. B. Norovirus in shellfish. C. Metal shavings in a can of peaches. D. Tomato juice served in a pewter pitcher. 
The correct answer is B. Norovirus in shellfish. Which is a big 8 food allergen? A. Broccoli. B. Wheat. C. Grapes. D. Pork. The correct answer is B. Wheat. Grease and condensation buildup on surfaces can be avoided with correct. A. Garbage disposal. B. Lighting. C. Sanitizing. D. Ventilation. The correct answer is D. Ventilation. Which food item may be handled with bare hands? A. Sliced cheese for sandwiches. B. Boiled egg slices for salad. C. Chopped carrots for stew. D. Parsley for garnish. The correct answer is C. Chopped carrots for stew. In a heat sanitizing dishwasher, what is the minimum temperature for the final rinse? A. 152 degrees Fahrenheit 67 degrees Celsius. B. 180 degrees Fahrenheit 82 degrees Celsius. C. 192 degrees Fahrenheit 89 degrees Celsius. D. 200 degrees Fahrenheit 93 degrees Celsius. The correct answer is B. 180 degrees Fahrenheit 82 degrees Celsius. A food handler who is receiving a food delivery observes signs of pests in the food. What should be done? A. The head chef should be warned of the pests. B. The food handler should remove all evidence of the pests. C. The shipment should be refused and prevented from entering the operation. D. The shipment should be stored outside the kitchen until a manager inspects it. The correct answer is C. The shipment should be refused and prevented from entering the operation. What information should a master cleaning schedule contain? A. What should be cleaned and when? B. What should be cleaned, when, and by whom? C. What should be cleaned, when, by whom, and how? D. What should be cleaned, when, by whom, how, and why? The correct answer is C. What should be cleaned, when, by whom, and how? Which individual should apply pesticides in a food service operation? A. A pest control operator. B. A shift manager. C. A busboy. D. A cook. The correct answer is A. A pest control operator. Which does not require sanitizing? A. Plates. B. Knives. C. Walls. D. Tongues. The correct answer is C. Walls. When must a consumer advisory be provided for menu items containing TCS food? A. When the item is raw or undercooked. B. When the item contains a potential allergen. C. When the operation provides only counter service. D. When the operation primarily serves a high risk population. The correct answer is A. When the item is raw or undercooked. Cold food being held without temperature control for up to six hours cannot exceed which temperature while it is being served? A. 41 degrees Fahrenheit 5 degrees Celsius. 
B. 50 degrees Fahrenheit 10 degrees Celsius. C. 60 degrees Fahrenheit 16 degrees Celsius. D. 70 degrees Fahrenheit 21 degrees Celsius. The correct answer is D. 70 degrees Fahrenheit 21 degrees Celsius. After scraping and washing, what is the third step in cleaning and sanitizing a prep table? A. Sanitizing. B. Air drying. C. Rinsing. D. Rewashing. The correct answer is C. Rinsing. The six conditions bacteria need to grow are food, acidity, temperature, time, oxygen, and A. Meat. B. Moisture. C. Melatonin. D. Management. The correct answer is B. Moisture. Which surfaces must be both cleaned and sanitized? A. Walls. B. Cutting boards. C. Storage shelves. D. Garbage containers. The correct answer is B. Cutting boards. A food handler with a sore throat and a fever should be excluded from working in a daycare center because the children A. Will not receive the same level of service. B. Could make the food handler more sick. C. Are a high-risk population. D. Will refuse to eat. The correct answer is C are a high-risk population. A food handler working in a hotel removes cold tuna salad from the cooler at 9 a.m. and delivers it to a conference room for an 11 a.m. buffet luncheon, where it is held without temperature control. By what time must the tuna salad be served or thrown out? A. 12 p.m. B. 2 p.m. C. 3 p.m. D. 4 p.m. The correct answer is C. 3 p.m. A boozer poured some cleaner from its original container into a smaller working container. What else does the boozer need to do? A. Label the working container with its contents. B. Read the safety data sheet, SDS, for the cleaner. C. Use a new wiping cloth when first using the working container. D. Note on the original container that some cleaner was put into a working container. The correct answer is A. Label the working container with its contents. The water provided to a hand washing sink must be A. Hot water only. B. Cold water only. C. Potable water only. D. Fluoridated water only. The correct answer is C. Potable water only. A cook wore single use gloves while forming raw ground beef into patties. The cook continued to wear them while slicing hamburger buns. What mistake was made? A. The cook did not wear reusable gloves while handling the raw ground beef and hamburger buns. B. The cook did not clean and sanitize the gloves before handling the hamburger buns. C. The cook did not wash hands before putting on the same gloves to slice the hamburger buns. D. The cook did not wash hands and put on new gloves before slicing the hamburger buns. The correct answer is D. The cook did not wash hands and put on new gloves before slicing the hamburger buns. Using the same knife to chop carrots for a salad immediately after cutting up raw chicken is an example of A. 
Time temperature abuse. B. Cross contamination. C. Poor personal hygiene. D. Purchasing from an unapproved supplier. The correct answer is B. Cross contamination. Which symptom could mean a customer is having an allergic reaction to food? A. Coughing. B. Dehydration. C. Swollen lips. D. Sneezing. The correct answer is C. Swollen lips. Which is an example of physical contamination? A. Sneezing on food. B. Touching dirty food contact surfaces. C. Bones in fish. D. Cooking tomato sauce in a copper pan. The correct answer is C. Bones in fish. To prevent food allergens from being transferred to food. A. Clean and sanitize utensils before preparing an allergen special order. B. Buy food from trusted suppliers. C. Store cold food at 41 degrees Fahrenheit 5 degrees Celsius or lower. D. Avoid pewter tableware and utensils and copper cookware. The correct answer is A. Clean and sanitize utensils before preparing an allergen special order. A food handler drops the end of a hose into a mop bucket and turns the water on to fill it. What has the food handler done wrong? A. Created a cross connection. B. Created an air gap separation. C. Prevented backflow. D. Prevented atmospheric vacuuming. The correct answer is A. Created a cross connection. Which is a chemical contaminant? A. Bones in a chicken fillet. B. Norovirus in shellfish. C. Metal shavings in a can of peaches. D. Tomato juice served in a pewter pitcher. The correct answer is D. Tomato juice served in a pewter pitcher. A hand washing station should have hot and cold water, soap, a way to dry hands, and A. A. Garbage container. B. Second timer. C. Clock. D. Gloves. The correct answer is A. Garbage container. What is the correct way to store mops in between uses? A. Propped in a corner. B. In a clean bucket. C. In a utility sink. D. Hanging on a hook. The correct answer is D. Hanging on a hook. What food item does the FDA advise against offering on a children's menu? A. Rare cheeseburgers. B. Cheese pizza. C. Peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. D. Fried shrimp. The correct answer is A. Rare cheeseburgers. Where should garbage cans be cleaned? A. Away from food and utensils. B. Next to food prep areas. C. In dishwashing areas. D. In food storage areas. The correct answer is A. Away from food and utensils. How high must legs be on table-mounted equipment? A. At least 1 inch, 3 centimeters. B. 
at least 2 inches, 5 centimeters. C. At least 4 inches, 10 centimeters. D. At least 6 inches, 15 centimeters. The correct answer is C. At least 4 inches, 10 centimeters. What are the most important food safety features to look for when selecting flooring, wall, and ceiling materials? A. Absorbent and durable. B. Hard and durable. C. Porous and durable. D. Smooth and durable. The correct answer is D. Smooth and durable. Which feature is most important for a chemical storage area? A. Good lighting. B. Single use towels. C. Non skid floor mats. D. Emergency shower system. The correct answer is A. Good lighting. To prevent backflow, a sink must be equipped with a N. A. Air gap. B. Vacuum assist. C. Overflow drain. D. Touchless controls. The correct answer is A. Air gap.